so what I was gonna ask y'all, all right, so like this year we're playing to see what happens, you know, maybe they blow it up by January and then we see the young guys play, maybe they don't, whatever. 2020 free agent class is trash, so we can't even think about next year signing some guys. Would it be 2021 we look to get guys or do we like use our our assets to make a trade and who would you guys trade for to have a star? That's a Pablo. Oh, there was a Twitter question on there. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Pull up the exact question. Like, sure. Pablo G. I think that's what uh, yeah, yeah. Pull up, pull Me personally, I'm done with the whole free agent wave. I mean, you want to position yourself and we have positioned ourselves that if there was an opportunity that we there could jump on it, you know what I mean? And you want to be cap responsible, but at the same time, at this point, you can't put all your eggs in a basket of free agents. You got to build from within. So. Two years from now, you're gonna be looking to extend so, guys. You know what I mean? Who might become creators? You, you, yeah. you, you gotta create your own stars. Yeah, like, yeah. How, like how we did it, like how we did it during our best years. years. Yeah. In our best it, years. But Chris, an opportune trade. I'm talking my bad. No, you're an good, opportune you're trade to make. I would say the only the only two or three guys you're looking at: Devin Booker. You're looking at um. Uh, what's his name on the Minnesota Timberwolves? Town. Uh, Town. 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 Yeah, so Three from Pablo G, he says, which star would you trade quite a few of our assets for, including first round picks? Towns, Booker, no. Bradley Beal, Aaron Gordon, uh, Andre Drummond, or CJ McCollum? Yeah, none of them. Drummond. Pass. Oh. Pass them Towns and Booker. I would, I would, Towns. Doing Bradley Beal was on the Bradley Beal. Yeah, yeah, Bill's on the list. I like, I like, I like to you know, I think CJ. You don't think Towns, Even at, Towns and Bill? If you can do that. From yeah, like, I don't see. Yeah, I don't see for I don't all those think, assets. Bill, I, I don't think, think is our best chance for CJ. He's not going to be disgruntled enough. No. Well, he just re-up. He just re-up with them. Right, and he just. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, so I think. I think it's going to go down to Booker. Yeah, Towns, and Bill. Bill, because those markets realistically. Yeah, they they they. In the next two years, and I think they Bill, I think he's going to feel the most more. more, more. You think Cat? You think yeah. even with Randall here, you think you think Cat would be the most real? I mean, if that works, I you use Randall. Yeah, you use Randall. I think Randall's one probably one of the ones we'll right. swap. Which I'm. I, look, I hope Bye. everything goes well with it, but yeah. for Cat. Yeah, I take Cat because Cat and Mitch can work. Let him play the four. Yeah, you, you know that's what I'm saying. The Let small ball era is kind of done because the Golden State's over with, and only okay. Houston would do that to, to adjust. Yeah, so. so after Houston and Golden State pretty much are done doing that, every else, every other team got big centers. So you, size is going to be like necessary. So Mitch could play with Towns because Towns can shoot. We don't know how the West is going to make. It's the same thing like the Lakers, man. Yeah, with like a uh, McGee and Anthony Davis thing, we can do. Cat I would do it for Bill more than any of those three. I, I think Bill. I love Bill. Yeah. yeah. Beal over, over, I'll yeah. go Beal over Booker. Who we giving up? Me oh, too, yeah. man. It's just not a crazy back. Uh, I'm not Randall, Dennis Smith Jr., Trayer, and a pick, go. I guess. Maybe two picks. I'm cool with that. That's all good with me. I'm cool with all those stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. but it's not yes. like... He's asking, I think, you know what? Like, I think that's what about what? They're going to want guards. They, they're gonna we want got all the guards. We got like bad guards. Who do you want? They're going to want either Trayer. They're going to want Trayer. I'll give them Trayer. They're going to want Trayer. I'll give them Trayer. For Beal. They're going to want Trayer. And they're going to want either Knox or Barrett. I, I, I think they're going to want RJ. They're going to want RJ. Well, yeah, because they got the Hoi Hachimura, who's like the same guy. They're going to be looking to make a splash, man. Yeah, they're going to want RJ. You think? Yeah, you're right, because they got Hachimura. I would, I would, I would like, how about y'all take like, um, but Dennis, they would take Dennis because John Wall might not come Dennis, back the same. But, but I'm, you know, when they negotiate, they're gonna say, look, they're gonna ask for the opposite. I give, I give them the Dallas picks to sweeten it. Yeah, yeah. Take those course. Dallas picks. But we gotta keep, we gotta keep all your picks. Yeah, at this point, that's the point. So you got, so you getting ready to get rid of everything you got, you got back for Porzingis then. I do. So it's Bradley Beal for Porzingis, I guess. And Porzingis, watch Porzingis be, I mean, an All Star this year. Chris believes that. Oh no, I'm not convinced. Here we go. I think he wears down by January. Why Bill over? Why Bradley Beal over Booker though? That was um, a bad day. Bad day. I think Bradley Beal does more. <laughs> yeah, I agree. He can I agree. Facilitate I agree. better. He, Ooh, I'm he sorry. Who can run you off Bill. the Bill. 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 And he's more, he's more of a mature player. He's, he's right. Right. I trust him more. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And he right. just does so many sure, things. Bro. Yeah. He uh, does. I, nothing I, against Bill. I like Booker. I like him, but the thing is, a lot of his points are empty. A lot of the games exactly. he's had his big and games. I'm blown right. And doesn't defend. Doesn't even bring that up. Is that him or on Phoenix though? For not helping him. But the thing is, if he's putting that's up him. 70, 50, 40s, and they're losing by 20, 20 bro. that's but on Also, the management's failed him, too, because he's had coaches. I'm not disagreeing. They're trading guys. They don't I hate Dolan, guys. but Carver's probably just as bad yeah. over there owning yeah. that team. Oh, yeah. he definitely is. Yeah. But at the same time, you can't be putting up all those points and not able to be in the game, at least. Yeah. Right. Yeah. They're getting blown out. Not even like a 30 No, well, last time we were looking at the first time around when we were listening to Porzingis, we asked for Booker. Yeah. Oh, I remember that. Yeah. 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 You want a book? I didn't. Book. We asked for I'm sorry. I would have taken a book. We asked for Mitchell. Yeah. I heard we asked for uh, who else was. We're not trading Mitchell. No way. No, no, no. Donovan. 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 Don
Oh, what's the over I'm under on Mitchell shooting much. threes this year? Y'all think Mitchell's gonna pop some threes? <laughs> I've been waiting. He didn't probably shoot probably any in summer league. Like, I know, man. He hyped us up. He didn't take any. I was so bad. Yeah, I don't. That coach is not ready for anything. Two years away. Two years away. Maybe like a blowout game. He like shoots one as a joke. He's not ready. They're gonna start confidence in there. I'm not sure. So he's gonna. They're gonna force him to shoot like maybe mid range. I just hope he stays healthy. That's yeah, yeah, that too. Ain't gotta learn how not get You need Taj. That's why I don't mind even with the money. Like, small ball center. Spend it, and it's only technically a one year deal. <laughs> yeah, yeah, man. I guess it's hurt. I think, I think it's when we sign him is still what yeah. hurts me. Right. And when I think, when I think about Taj, like, you're right. I'm not disagreeing. You're right. Yeah. It's, it's Taj, gonna work Taj out. Taj and Bobby pick up. Taj is gonna be guarding Joel Embiid. He's gonna be guarding Al Harford. Yeah, you're right. Bobby Jordan. What's his name? And he's Lisa stretching out on the Orlando Magic. He's yeah. in threes and stuff. So yeah, he's gonna be a good piece for us at yeah, the five. You're not wrong. Piece, we don't we don't really have any. We lost Bobby. No exactly. one's talking enough about Bobby. Cole. I think I like Bobby. I think he'll fit. I, I think he's a stretch too. five. Yeah, and a rebound. Bobby's got heart. He's got heart. Bobby's they see for, for a long thing? time, our team has been missing that heart. It's been missing that heart for a long time. Yeah, Morris and Bobby bring the heart. That's exactly why I'm not that upset. Because like right now. We have too many like young guys, which is great, but you also have to like balance it out with some veteran presence. And our, veteran pre our main veteran presence is Taj. Taj is from the city of New York. His dad is a Knicks fan. Yeah. So like, there's not only I don't want to say expectations on it, but like I like I said, I feel like there's a difference when you put it for your whole yeah, time. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Yeah. Yeah. I feel you know, like Taj is no nonsense. Huge. Like, what you to me doesn't necessarily mean the same to you or any of you. In this, you know. And he's 34, so he's he'll be good, but only in spurts. Like he can't carry. Right. But that's, yeah. a, that's he, he's not here. He's not, he's not here to carry the team. Yeah, that's how we were using. That's the same. The same way that we the same way that we're using last time, like Lance. Right. Is but this time. With a more, more talented player, more production, yeah. You know, he was hurt last year. Like, Taj like garners more respect. Like yeah. he'll have more respect yeah, in the locker absolutely. room from these guys than Lance. Who was the guys absolutely. in the locker room last year to help get the respect level going? Yeah, I guess DeAndre was DJ. DeAndre, DeAndre was like DeAndre, 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 yeah. DeAndre was just yeah. DJ. Yeah. yeah. I mean, listen, Lance, Lance was a captain. I mean, say what you yeah. know, they voted him. And the players respect that Lance. Lance came from. Yeah, but not like that. He's not the kind of guy to like go in the locker room, no, fire not. guys up, and but like, you know. And, and then you gotta like you have to have um, a presence on the court. Right. Yeah. Exactly. I like Lance. I like Lance. Lance is a good guy, but like, but like his work. He doesn't have that fire in him. Yeah, it's work. It's work ethic. They'll lead by example, and like you said, yeah. work ethic. They'll work hard with him. Mm -hmm. They'll mm -hmm. they won't stay out late and party and stuff like that. Oh, but as far as like I mean, on the court things that translate, I don't think he's going to be effective in like motivating. Fizzle Fiz already said, you know, he doesn't have to worry about his players going out. He has to worry about his players staying up all night playing Fortnite. Right. That's crazy. Uh -huh. that's, 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 young that's, that's the young generation. How many, yeah. how many guys we got on the team under like 23? That's a lot, right? A lot. Knox barely turned 20, man. They all yeah. love that Fortnite. I think, oh, sorry, I think that's Yo, only Yo, Knox is only not playing it with Dolan's nephews and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. Mitch Robinson. Yeah, Mitch plays? Yeah, Mitch Robinson. All the young kids. All of them, man. What up? Like, so he came to bat for Fizz during that next media day. He was saying that everybody, for the most part, bought in Lance. Yeah. That was kind of surprising. Yeah. 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 I'm sure they bought in Lance. Lance. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Right, 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 right. Last year's roster was designed to tank. Yeah. yeah. They, that was, they bought in. <laughs> yeah. They all got along. There wasn't that many rips, you know what I mean? But it was designed to tank. Like, look. That, yeah, was that was a perfectly designed all, team. I'll tell you, perfect. all misfits from other teams that trash bus. You know what I mean? Yeah, this a collection. Yeah, yeah, very similar. We don't have that this year. Last year we had literally draft no, bus. No, really. Zonia we got more of a talented. It was more reclamation. Bonley who didn't do anything. Oh yeah, Bonley. Zonia did a lot. Zonia did a lot. Got drafted in the lottery. Did nothing. Now we have guys. To your point, it's the same thing, just with more talent. We got more talent. Randall has been on three teams in four years. Right. Every other guy. Stable talent. Stable talent. Is it? You know, these guys have all, these guys are Hopefully. all signed a bunch of journeymen that haven't really yeah. found their, Bobby. their place in the league. Perry all can't give up on his draft picks. Yeah. He does not give up right. on his draft picks. Right, he is like a, 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 a possessive boyfriend. Yeah. yeah. They'll let you go. Oh, oh God, God, you're right. Oh, I, I mean, I think it's a random situation. Yeah. 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 Uh, I think a random situation was just yeah. more... Listen. The circumstances that was it. Right. You know what I mean, like with the Lakers, it was they wanted LeBron and Paul George. Right. You had Kuzma that was kind of fit that mold of what LeBron was going to bring to the team. Right. Uh, they didn't want to put that money in the ring. He goes to the Pelicans, does his thing. But they don't win. But then they rebuild and trade AD, and right. then they got Zion. So well, there was really no need. But it's yeah. similar to what happened with David Lee. If you look at his numbers, right. David Lee was averaging 20 and 10. Yeah, we could have kept David Lee in that side. They wanted Amari Stoudemire. You know what I mean? So we let David Lee go. It didn't mean he was, like, trash. But, you know, 
even even Randall's a much better player than David Lee was. You know what I mean? Yeah. 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 As far as like he's not a better can, rebounder. Not, not a better rebounder. Not a better rebounder. But but the offense, offense for sure. He's a better low post player. David Lee was better one. Yeah. Low far and on defense. Really 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 defensively, they're about the same. Yeah. Yeah. And he's getting better too. Randall's still getting better. Yeah. Yeah. Defensively is a problem though. Nick's Lakers was table a couple years ago. I was talking to a, a Lakers fan, and we were talking about Julius Randle. Julius Randle was lighting up the Knicks that day, and I was asking him, "Do you want to resign Randle?" He said, "You know, the thing about Julius is like he really doesn't have a position. He's like he's not a four, he's not a five. Mm-hmm. You know, he doesn't play. He doesn't really play defense. He's mm-hmm. kind of undersized. Like he's like the he's like I really he's like I like him. I just don't know. know I just don't know where he true. fits, and yeah. I wouldn't give. I was like I wouldn't put that but have money in him. Right." And, yeah, I feel like he'll be a guy where he'll get money through his 20s and put up numbers, and then he'll help a team when he's like older, like and, and, and like be that six man off the bench. And he'll, he, or he could have a Zach Randolph like career because Randolph put up a lot of stats and wasn't winning, and then he found his niche on the Clippers and Memphis. I'm good. Yeah, you can, it's a ghost stuff. If you want. Yeah, pack it up. Yeah, now if Randolph's gonna be. Interesting. I think he could be like a Zach Randolph. Oops. Just except, you know, they, they but Zach was a big character. Zach was double his rebound. <laughs> yeah. I think Randall can get that too, though, with the, with yeah, the playing time. I think you, you give him the minutes. Game two years ago. Yeah. yeah. With the minutes, he'll get that. Yeah. That's easy. Yeah. Yeah. Plus, yeah. Yeah. and he goes to the line a lot, too. Free throws. Yeah. Yeah. Isn't it crazy? Like, is he on ranking? I did. It was I don't. So, it was ESPN rankings. You just did a video on the ranking. So, Julius Randall, two years ago, was like 47. Yeah, he was high. Right? He was 40 something. Before that. And he was averaging oh, okay, 16 okay. points a game. Yeah, right. He, he increased his scoring total. He averaged 21, mm-hmm. 8.7, yeah. four oh, down. Over 50% <laughs> shooting. And he went to, to, to 90, 90 second players, right? 92 this year? 92, yeah. bro. Yeah. Now, Chris Dodd was play. Was like, what? He was 50 something, right? He was injured the whole, the whole season. The whole season. Mm-hmm. Gonna miss some like games this season. Is it because of what they, this is what they expect a guy to be this good this year, not mm-hmm. as what you but, did but that if, that's the, if that's the case, right. now, now Randall's on a team, but the offense is finally going to be. He was, dra- he was dropping 21 on a, on a squad that was ran through Davis, right? right. Now he got a team that's going to be ran around him. Why would you not project it? <laughs> exactly. And that's what I'm saying, because they said that this list is based off of how they're going to look this coming season, their impact to the team's that they're on this coming season. That makes no sense that Julius Randle, because of everything not. you just said, right. 92, he's going to be probably our best player on the team, so at least a 60. At least. At least. At least. Yeah, he, I would say he's a top 60. So we got Joe Zion Harris. Wilson at 42. They had Joe Harris better than... Um, yeah, fuck no. Joe, oh, sorry. Joe, who else? Um, <laughs> who else? Joe, Joe Harris. I, I can go. I, I, I'm ready. Joe Harris, Ricky Rubio. Um, I like them, Van Vliet. I can go. I'm ready. Yeah, like, you they, can't have backups over that, starting yeah, up. Yeah, that's Only true. like Lou Williams yeah. can you put like in that top fifteen. Yeah, that's that's true. Oh, but just the, listen, the, that, that finals, you could have argued he was the MVP. If it, that, you know, a lot of times finals MVPs is a lot of popularity. Right. It, it, it is. He yeah. came in the clutch. He was, yeah. Yeah. came in the clutch in those, two, in those two or three games. Two games. Two games. The yeah. important yeah. game. Not, not they gave it to Kawhi, right? Yeah, gave to Kawhi, yeah. Kawhi, Kawhi was doing all four games. Yeah, don't get me started about those. You know, there's so yeah. much Nick bias, man. You, you look at all year long. It was a three-man draft, right? It was Morant, Barrett, and Zion. Pretty much. As soon as the Knicks ended up with the third pick, they started saying it's a two-man draft. Yeah, they all did. of a sudden, all of a sudden, instantly, Barrett was no longer looked at it the same way he was looked at before. And I felt like they were way too hard on him. Like, I'm not going to lie. His, the, I watched a lot of Duke because I was it's praying for Zion. Boy. I spent the whole year of my life praying all, for Zion. We, yeah. all, we were all praying. But the, the RJ hate came in hard because of just how he would do annoying things on the court. Like, you just see it. Like, there was open shots that he would just take Priority. it up. Mm-hmm. Stay on the left, never yeah, use right. Hard, yeah. But they, the, and they, he disappeared in the tournament. Just like, he, did, he, did. he just didn't make he did. shots. At the free throw. But it was the free throw. But the team has like that every Leveled yeah, 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 yeah. As a team, that's, they were horrible shooting saying. wise. Like they, they had no they, shooting, there was no space. In. And yeah. you get RJ some shooters, yo, it's gonna be such a different but, game. But this is the thing: they asked RJ to play the point, the two, and yeah. the three. They didn't trust Trey Jones. Trey Jones wasn't wasn't handling the ball. He was more defensive, no, secondary. secondary. Trey Jones he should have been in the draft, draft, but after how he played Trey last Jones year, wasn't creating. No, yeah. Zion was not wasn't looking. creating. Yeah, everything fell on RJ. Yeah. And the whole like him not showing up, him missing free throws. This is what's crazy: the game that um RJ misses free throws, right? 
the game before that, did Zion not miss a free throw yeah. to win yeah. the game? Yeah. Who yeah. rebounded it? RJ got that. Yeah. Yeah. And that's why they yeah. won. But nobody talks about oh Zion on here. Yeah, they, they don't. Like they they, they the game ready. ready. He's gonna they be a Same thing as Zion. Zion was like yeah. six yeah. or seven. But a wing, is, a wing is just differently than a big when it comes to like shooting and free throw. So like a, a guy who's a wing, a six, six, or seven guy, you should be making over seventy percent of your free throws. So for RJ to be in the sixties. <laughs> True, but Don's un he's an undersized big though. Like he's Bar he's a Barkley. Seven. Larry Johnson. He's that kind of big. He's not a good man wing. But I feel you. Though, but a wing is supposed to be a better shooter. Going to the basket. Yeah. But I think RJ. Let me find it. RJ. He's gonna be our our main ball handler. Like yeah. as the season progresses, if, if I feel like I'm going the right way. I gotta go through my meter. Yeah, no problem. I'm getting my phone call. That's the audio. Yeah, I'm right behind you too. That's funny. RJ's gonna be one of the main facilitators. He's gonna be one of the main ball handlers. I don't know if it works for the two for him though, because his wiggle. I don't think he has that wiggle. He don't have the wiggle. wiggle. And he should be a three. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna say that just yet. Maybe long term. Long term. But I think he could develop the wiggle. I know. As he works on his body and his handle, for sure the wiggle will get better. I just feel like coming into the rookie year, I don't think he should play the two. He should play the three. But it's like he does his moves. He step with whoever's the two. Like that starting five. Should we do everybody starting five? Yeah. Let's do it. Wait. Let's wait. Let's wait for the nigga back.